Go. We just moved. Oh, we just moved to another place. This is the famous Rainbow Camp. We've just taken a, one of the float planes out here. It's an amazing sight. We're only like half an hour, three quarters of an hour away, but because we've come over the mountains, totally different. Overcast where we've had sun before. Feels like a totally different day in a totally different country. And this is about my third or fourth cast. I'm standing on a gravel bar on the, the famous confluence where two rivers meet. And there's a lovely little run, natural line out here. It's only a short cast. And even on the first couple of casts, we had fish boil at the fly. They're here, as I well know, because I'm well and truly hooked into one. You can't beat this. Can't beat it. See if we can get this fish up in the current and get it in the net. It's a lovely looking silver. I'm not sure if it's a hen or a cock. I think it might be a hen. You think it's a hen? Yeah? Whoa! I'll tell you what I'll do. If you stay there, I'll walk back. So we get that nicely in the net. Oh, strong. There we go. There we go. Nice job, well done. Small male, I was wrong. <laughs> oh, it is a small male. Yeah, nice lovely, job. beautiful fish. Look at that. Oh, look how deep he's taken that fly. They want it this morning. They do, it's in his throat, isn't it? Yeah, that's pretty deep. <laughs> I'll hold the net while you get that yeah. out. Lovely fresh run fish. <clears throat> and at this location, we're only how far? Are we a mile, mile and a half? From about the, a mile. About a mile from the Bering Sea. That's a fresh, one of the freshest spots to catch these fish. Yep. Let's just hook that on there so it's out of everyone's way. Stick the rod under my arm and have a look at this. Smallish run this time. Yeah. They're all beautiful fish. Look at that. Absolutely stunning. First one from the famous confluence at Rainbow Camp. That's right. So get him back in the water. Give it a nice little breather. Keep them upstream. Oops, I don't let go of my rock. Oops. Nice fish, my friend. <laughs> and he's gone, he was ready to go. <laughs> See if we can get another one. <clears throat> On here, I've got a pink salmon fly, <clears throat> leaded eyes to give it a little bit of weight. Tony's in again. <laughs> it's already in. <clears throat> I'll go through this because I want to cast back out there as quick as possible. As I said, pink salmon fly, 15 pound straight through leader. I've got probably what, two feet of line there. And the swim I'm fishing here, because the current's quite fast, it's not too deep. What we're using is one of these teeny sink tip lines. It's got the black sink tip there, it's a midi tip. So it's only a short, about two feet. You can see where it joins the, the main floating line there. Basically, an eight weight rod with a suitable reel that can hold enough backing because in this current and these fresh run fish, it's not unusual that when you hook them on their first run, they'll take you right down to the backing. So Tony's into some fish. I think Phil might actually be in for fish, I'm not sure as well, so time for me to strip some line and uh, see if we can get this out there again. And just a short cast, upstream men, upstream men, and then it's a strip, strip, a little pause, a little, another little mend, strip, strip, pause. We're right in the hot spot now. Strip, strip, pause. 
strip, strip, pause. I've just come past. Nothing that time. Let's just lay the line out and just put it out there again. This one's giving me a right to it, eh? <laughs> Try and get this line on the reel. <clears throat> Came swimming at me so fast when I set that hook, I did not have a chance. I would dearly like to try and just get him out of that run if possible, so he doesn't scare too many other fish. Keep him away from the others. Got my back to you, but just trying to bring him upstream. <sighs> You're not getting back in there. Come on, out. <sighs> There's a lot more fish sitting in there and I'm going to try and keep them away from the others so I don't scare them too much. They get less pressure on them. <sighs> you can see why people love catching these fish so much, can't you? Oh, a turn of speed, especially in this shallow water. Ooh. It's phenomenal. Lovely silver fish again. Round you come, it's like walking a dog. Turn, 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 turn. Keep your head up so you can't get any speed. Nope. <laughs> it does look like a hen, doesn't it? A lovely silver fish. Whoa, I'm gonna have to walk back a bit. Just like this. Just try and let it know that we're in charge. Keep, keep that head out of the water. And it's in the net. Good job. Oh, she's a nice fat fish. Oh, what's all the marks on that? Fly out that fish. Excellent, well done. Didn't take long, isn't it? What's that? Five minutes since we've had the last one? Beautiful. Is that on both sides or? Um, yes, it is. Yeah, Look at that. See the fresh sea lace on her Yeah. So it'll just hold us straight back in the water and we'll let this one go. Lovely hen fish. Nice and strong. Look at that. Fresh, fresh. It's all the way up like that. Yep. Just like that. <laughs> nice job. Excellent. Brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. And all it is, is a matter of unhooking this fly. Putting a bit of line off. It's got a hell of a headwind, but it's not a problem because it's a short what, 20, 30 feet cast, if that. I'm going to creep back into position. See if we haven't scared the swim and the lie too much. Let's see if we can sneak another one out. There we go, another strong fish taking a long, long run. Tons and tons of line. Ooh. This one's got a bit of colour in it, so I know this one's been in the river for a little bit longer. Ooh. He's not very happy. I don't know if you can see him bow waving behind me, pushing the water, pushing upstream. Nice boils. Just make the rod do all the work. <laughs> they have fantastic fun. Do you know, I think it's more enjoyable fishing for these in the shallower water than the deep water because these fish have got an immense amount of strength and when they want to run there's only one way they can go and that's out instead of down. Whoa, just like that, look. <laughs> He's angry. Oh, is this fish going to come back? having me all over this pool, this one is. Oh, it's swimming towards me. 
as quick as they can power off, they can power towards you up in the current. It's a strong fish. Look at that eight weight rod. <laughs> this must be about the 10th run it's done. It's what salmon fishing is all about. Catching these beautiful fish. We're starting to huff and puff. Look at that kiting up there. Right across that gravel bar. Beautiful sight. Ooh, come on, this way, this way. Turn this way, come on. Just pump and wind with the reel. He's coming towards me now. Come on, come on, baby. Right beside my feet. He's not going to like it when he sees me. <laughs> oh, some excellent jumps. Absolutely excellent. Oh, look at, oh, look at the power. Just the way to turn that fish has turned excellent. You can see that pink fly just on his nose. That big fat Alaskan salmon. Whoa, fantastic, absolutely. Whoa. So much power, this water's nice and cold, well oxygenated. These things have come from the sea. They are lean machines. Whoa, right, if I can get hold of this fish, I've just got hold of a leader, I'm ready to let it go at any minute. Let me get him to come up above me. I'm gonna see if I can get hold of his tail. Excellent. Look at that. Oh, what an absolutely beautiful fish. Here's that fly perfectly in that corner. Look at that. That fish gave me one hell of a scrap. Absolutely one hell of a scrap. Pure muscle. Now I'll tell you what, that's got a considerable amount of weight to that fish. Let's put the rod between my legs. Let's see if we can pop the fly out like that. Get hold of him, ready for a release. Look at that. One last look. Beautiful. Mwah. Absolutely. I could catch these all day. Absolutely all day. Are you going to swim upstream or are you going to go down? Unbelievable. Magic. Well, we've just come up river won't buy boat we've come well half a mile up the rainbow river to another little lovely sweeping bend here my guide says to me start up here i'm going to work this far bank just taking the two or three steps every two or three casts up until we get to this middle section I reckon that bit's not too productive so i'm going to skip that work this skip that and then we get around the corner have another little go around that side so let's just get a line out exactly the same setup as before See if there's anybody home in here. Um, oh, yeah, here we go. Oh, nice take. <laughs> Thought I felt a little twitch and a bump there a second ago. Ooh. Lovely. Come round. Look at that. It's magnificent. We can just see that pink fly on the end of their nose. What I'm going to try and do is get some of this line back on this reel. In case, way here we go. <laughs> Up comes all the commotions. That's the power of these uh, silver salmon from Alaska. The rain's really started to 
pour down on us. Nice drizzle. We had a lovely morning, but now this is uh, typical weather at this time of year when the silvers are running. But we don't come here for a suntan. We come here to get a bend in these rods. Come on, lovely fish. I'll tell you what, I might even try and tail this one. If I can bring it up in the current. Bring it, come on. Come on, that's a good girl. Keep your head up, keep your head up. Woohoo! Just so I can get hold of that line. Ooh. Get ready to let it go if I need to let it go. Come on. Come round. Look at that fly. Whoa! <laughs> Trying to go through my legs. Come on. Come on, baby. Yes! Look at that. Beautiful, small hen fish. As fresh as they come. They don't get much fresher than that. Sea lice on its back tail. And we're even further up the river from the Bering Sea. Beautiful. I'm just going to see if I can pop that hook out. Fly out of there. Whoa. Look at that. We'll have one last look at her. Wait. Give her a little kiss. Mwah. Oh, I can hear salmon rolling behind me. There's a few pushing up in this fresh water with the rain. I'm going to let this one go about doing her business to make sure there's plenty more fish in this river. A few dranglers. I'm wet. Chilly, but I don't care because I'm so so happy. 